Hey guys, welcome to the channel. You've reached Adventures in Magic. Today, we're going to show you some serene spots where you can find some quiet. And right now, we're just walking through the back end of Fantasyland and um, showing some places that are quiet and you can hang out. And right here, you also have the King and Queen bathrooms right behind Fantasyland and Alice in Wonderland. Hi guys, so we're back over here behind the Matterhorn and this is the um, waterfall coming off the Matterhorn. There's two sides to it. This is the side that faces um, Fantasyland and it's a really quiet, serene spot to just have a chill day. Um, and we're doing a voiceover just so you know. So then we're going to jump over towards the other side and we're going to show you the other side of the Matterhorn. And just a little jaunty daunt. And this is also where you can view Tinkerbell on the right hand side and um, the, the monorails on the left hand side. So you're basically watching, walking towards um, Tomorrowland and just follow the monorail and you're going to go to the other side and we'll just hang out for just a minute and just trying to show you guys where some nice quiet spots are. Anywhere around here this has tables and you can eat lunch and stuff and the, the live will stop every once in a while because I didn't have service so I apologize but right here is a really good spot um, to just hang out if you like the sound of water like me these are good places to hang out when it's not really um, crowded and today on this episode is not crowded in these areas it was about uh, noon on a Thursday in the lagoon you can see Hank and you can also hear the um, seagulls that say mine 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 from Finding Nemo and you can just sit here and chill out. Um, I did cut out a couple of parts so um, But yep, there's Hank and he was hanging out. You can watch the way. subs and the monorail right come here. in right now, and right out here. from this station That's It's just kind of a right good chill spot. spot And just kind of taking it in and relaxing for just a moment such a good spot, guys. Not good when you throw a bottle in the water, but... And then moving on, we're going to have... Um, coming up on the right is going to be a little spot in you know, just a corner where fast passes used to be. And that also used to be where the junior track was way back in the day you can still see parts of the track part of disneyland history there which is something i'm interested in and just follow the monorail track and you're going to follow it around and there's little benches off to the left and places for you guys to sit down and and just have a quiet moment lots of lots of uh nature and you can hear autotopia if that's something you like to listen to um, it's not real loud in my opinion. It's kind of faint. I just follow it and take it around. And you're going to find this little area over here. It's um, across in the Matterhorn. And it's got tables and an awning if it starts raining. There's a little awning right there. But that's for the little... Um, restaurant next door the little order out place to the Matterhorn and as you can see there's a little boat right there in the um, before they closed that's where the boats were and you could play with the boats um, I'm not sure if those were the ones that you could actually get into I don't know what happened there sorry give it a second um, but yeah so you can go over here and we're going to just go around a little bit. And as you can see, the 
the restaurant wasn't open that day. They were just hanging out. Um, there wasn't anything to order. So then you come around and there's the little small world on the left and a bunch of trees and you can still see the moat and then again this is where the monorail track is and they have all kinds of utensils and napkins and things you need and lots of people just pack their lunch and eat here which is really really nice um, the south, on the south end you can see um, small world and you can um, check it by every 15 minutes the sound will go off you can hear that from there there's lots of Disney ducks um, in this little moat right here which is really sweet and during the springtime there's lots of baby ducks so that's always good but as you can see I was just kind of showing off the ducks and they were being cute as usual Disney ducks are always so cute right so we'll just wait for it to move forward a bit give it a second I probably was talking about uh, small world and the little um, show building off to the left right there and the ducks were playing with each other which was kind of funny there's about seven or eight ducks and then to the left of me was about ten more so they were just kind of hanging out and it was raining a little bit on this day so we just were kind of hanging out so I was just trying to show you guys you know the eating space a nice quiet space this is one of my daughter's favorite spaces to go and chill out um, she uh, always wants to go here um, like I said she's on the spectrum and she gets a little stimulated sometimes with all the noise and people so that's how we work that and then we're gonna go out and I think that's gonna be pretty much it as you can tell it's thanks right for watching the don't forget horn. to like the video